Hello everyone, I am Steve, and I welcome you all to the full demonstration video on the latest version of Dashboard Ninja with AI, your ultimate Odoo dashboard generator, developed by KSolves India Limited. Dashboard Ninja is now fully equipped with the power of generative AI. In this video, I will create a dashboard from scratch using all the cool features of Dashboard Ninja with AI. The video is divided into two major sections. In the first half, we will generate a complete dashboard with AI, and in the second, we will do the same manually. So, let's get started. We will start with generating a complete dashboard with AI. Now, this is what your inbox will look like. Click on Discuss. Select My Dashboard. Just click on Generate Dashboard with AI. Now here, I will enter the model for sales order in the dashboard and menu name. I will enter Sales Dashboard. My show under menu would be My Dashboard. With that, we are set. Now click on Generate Dashboard with AI. Just like that, you can create a dashboard using AI. Now you can also generate dashboard items with AI by either model or keyword focused dashboard items. Now let's talk about it as we create our dashboard manually. So to create a new dashboard manually from scratch, click on new dashboard. Let's say you are a sales manager and you want an analysis of how your product sales are performing. Now for that, you want to create a sales dashboard. So here I will put the name as sales dashboard. You also have an option to select your predefined dashboard templates. Here we have template one, template two, and so on. You can choose any of them. Or if you want to start fresh, you can select a blank one. For the menu name, again, I will put sales dashboard. The show under menu will be my dashboard and let the sequence be selected as one. Save it. I am inside the personal dashboard. Now, if I have to create a new chart, I have a choice from 17 items including tiles, lines chart, bar graph, pie chart, funnel chart, and so on. So, let's generate an item with AI first. Select Generate with AI. Now, I will have two options. Either I will select Model or Keyword. Let us first go with Model. Here, I will put Sales Order. We'll click on Generate with AI. I will have an option here to select all the charts that I need to keep. Now, after saving it, our dashboard will look something like this. Similarly, you can create keyword-focused dashboard items. It is super easy and efficient. Now, let's create an item manually say a bar chart click on create new chart now here in this dashboard wizard i will enter the name of the chart say customer wise revenue in data source i have four options odoo excel csv external api i am picking the odoo option for now now for odoo data source i will select sales order model as it is a sales report we also have a company option this will help you in the instances like, say you have a multi-company setup and you want to select a respective company as per your requirement. You can do it right from here. Now I will have to enter the values in the respective fields, which will help me in building the bar chart. So in the measure, I want to go with the total sale order. For the data type, I will select sum. As the bar graph is meant for customer-wise revenue, I will group by customer sale dot order. Now this will tell me how much revenue is generated from the customers. You can see the revenue over here. So my basic bar chart is created. Now further, I have line measures and other options to further customize the chart. Say in the line measure, I selected currency rate sale dot order. You can see for currency, there is a dedicated line in the chart. I can also select a value in subgroup by say for order date sale dot order. Now, as I have selected order date, I will have to give a value for sort by field, whether I want it year wise, month or day wise. I will select year here. You can see as soon as I save and close, 
my bar chart is created over here. So, now you can see that my manually added bar chart is created, along with the AI generated items. Now I can edit this layout, I can stretch it, I can drag and drop it. Or if I want to filter out the data, according to the date, I have the date filter option. Along with these date filter options, we have a custom filter as well. I can select the to and from date and apply this filter. I have some themes, color palettes here I can choose from. Default, cool, warm, or neon. So we have these four predefined themes. I also have an option to duplicate or move this chart to some other dashboard. I can do this from here. I can remove this item if I want to. I can export this chart to Excel, CSV, PDF, Image, or I can direct Export Item. The info option lets us know that to which company this data belongs to. When I click on the eye icon, it gives us more information about the chart in the listed view. It provides the details of the same chart. Now I will go to the edit mode and will tell you more options of this chart. We'll go to full settings. Now here, under the display tab, I can select the relevant number system. I can select the color palette from here too. I am also getting an option here to keep it as stacked bar chart. I can enable the data value option here. Also, if there are any custom unit type, I can select it from here, select monetary here, or if you want to enter any custom unit, select custom and add your respective unit. Under actions tab, you get drill down or drill option to further enhance your visualization deeply. Further, we have the advanced configuration options to show the legends or records, which helps us in denoting which line denotes what. You've also got the item description over here to add a note about your chart. Once done, you can click on save and close. Now your complete dashboard looks like this. Now I can either print, mail, or import this dashboard as per my convenience. So we initially created a complete dashboard using AI. We then moved to create a manual dashboard where we generated dashboard items with AI and other features. Similarly, you can also create beautiful dynamic dashboards with Dashboard Ninja with AI. So, get started today and explore yourself. Hope this video helped you in understanding how to create a dashboard from scratch. We will be back with a video series explaining all the specific features, modules soon. Stay tuned.